Hey guys, it's your girl KB. I'm back again with another video. I'm gonna be making sour milk. So my ingredient is gonna be using the plain sour milk, as you can see, that I bought from the African store. I'm gonna put it in this bowl I'm working on. I'm gonna dump it in here. I'm using the whole cup so so that way the milk can make and you know this is the yoga I'm using this one I got it from the African store I'm, I never tried it before but I'm gonna try it right now and then I'm gonna use this sour cream which is called friendly friendship i'm gonna use that i got it from the african store too so i'm gonna be using all the cups too i'm gonna use the whole sour milk Ew. so i'm gonna put everything together as you can see i'm using all the cups and then I'm gonna stir it together, like mix it up a little bit, stir it up, stir it and stir it. As you can see, what I'm doing right now, I'm stirring it. And then, what are you gonna do? You're gonna put like a little bit, oh, a little. I don't have lemon, so I'm gonna use lime, the real lime juice. So, to give it that taste, it's sweet and sour taste, you know. So, I'm going to pour like a, oh, you just need a little bit, not too much. Like a teaspoon, but I'm not using a teaspoon, but I'm going to just pour a little bit just to give it that taste, as you can see what I'm doing right now. So, I'm just going to put it in, pour a little bit. Like I always tell you, if you're a good cook, you don't need no measuring you don't need no measuring spoon you don't need no measure your stuff you know exactly what to put in your food so as you can see i'm not using no measuring spoon no anything so now i'm going to put the sugar i'm going to put the sugar in it as you can see i'm using this kind of sugar you see that sugar I'm going to use that. I'm going to put it in the deeper. I want to put in this to do that because I don't want the sugar to be too sweet. So for this one, I just need to put a little bit of sugar. So as you can see, you put sugar in it and then you stir it up very good. Stir it and stir it and stir it. As you can see what I'm doing, keep stirring and make it look smooth. So that way your sour milk is not looking all lumpy and stuff. So you gotta make sure. Alright guys. I'm supposed to use like a fat free milk. But instead, I'm going to use a regular milk. So, I'm going to put some. See? Not too much. You don't want it too watery now. You want it like, not too watery. So, as you can see what I'm doing right now, I'm stirring it up. You have to make sure you stir it up very, very good. So it can be nice and smooth. So when you put it in the fridge, when it come up, it can look very, very good. So as you can see what I'm doing right now, I'm stirring it. I'm stirring, stirring very, very good. I have to stir it so the sugar can see it. 
And I'm going to give you a little taste. Mm. Guys, y'all got to try this. Y'all got to try this recipe. I am not kidding. Got to try it and you will see what I'm doing right now. Okay. Gonna do this. Stir it up good. Alright guys. As you can see. You want to see the finishing right here. I'm going to get, give you a little tour in me. So you can see what I'm doing right now. See as you can see right here. This is how it looks. Okay. So. I'm going to tie it up. And. And you're going to see what I'm going to do. Right now. Sorry if you see my hand shaking a lot. Because I'm trying to. Put this camera in a red position so you can be able to see what I'm doing. So I'm gonna do that. All right, so I'm gonna put it in the bag. As you can see I finished stirring it up. Everything. Mmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for this bag. You have to use this kind of bag. Do not use a zip lock bag. You have to use this kind of bag to be able to put your sour milk in. So it can come up good. So I'm going to use this school because you don't want to make it too big and thin. So you want to do this. And then you tie it up nice and and tight you don't want it all loose in and stuff so you want to make sure you give it a good tie you don't want it to stay in your fridge so you see what i'm doing right now i'm gonna tie it up quick see that's how it's supposed to look okay i'm gonna do more Gonna tie it up. As you can see. Okay. I'll be right back. So it's going to take a little bit of time for me to tie quick. So, I'm going to be back with you soon. So, just give me a minute. And I'm going to finish everything. You're going to see how, what I did. Alright. Hey guys, I'm back again. I'm almost done tying the sour milk. As you can see. I'm done with everything. So... I'm gonna put it in the fridge. I'm done with everything. I'm gonna put it in the fridge for it to freeze up. And that's how you make sour milk, guys. I want you to like this video, subscribe, and give this video a thumbs up. And tell me what would you like me to make again next. So guys, I love every one of y'all. So please go and subscribe to my video. And give my video a thumbs up. And talk to y'all later. Bye.